That darn dress. It's crazy you can be so sure about what you're seeing and still be wrong. It's the way I felt about my mullet in the 80s. Blue and grey, definite, 100%. White and gold. Oh, you're winding me up. Optical illusions have a tendency to break the internet. But it's not just your visual system that can play tricks on you. Your auditory system is just as guilty. In the same way that your brain likes filling in gaps when it comes to visual information, the same is true for auditory information. <coughs> Let me give you an example. I want you to listen to these three tones and decide in your head whether they're ascending or descending. Ready? What did you hear? I heard ascending, descending, ascending. But you might have heard something completely different. Try it with a friend and see what they hear. It's like the dress of auditory illusions. It's known as the tritone paradox and was discovered by auditory researcher Diana Deutsch in 1986. Diana concluded that where you were raised and the language that you speak could play a large part in how you hear those tones. Not only that, but you're more likely to hear those tones in the same way as your mum or Down. dad. Down. 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 Your brain can even make you see things that aren't there, depending on what auditory information it's receiving. Seriously. Count how many times you see this circle appear on screen. If you said twice, you'd be in the majority, but you'd be wrong. If we remove the audio, it becomes plainly obvious that this circle only appears once. This is known as the flashing circle illusion. It's a prime example of how audio can be used to change our vision. But it can also work the other way around. The McGurk effect shows us how visual information can actually change what we hear. Let me show you. This is me. Watch my mouth very closely bah, and tell me what bah, you hear. Bah, 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 bah. If you heard me saying ba ba ba, you'd be right. But what about now? Ba 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 ba. You probably heard me saying fa fa fa. And yet the audio hasn't changed. In both clips, you're only ever hearing me say ba with a b. Ba, Let's put the two ba, clips side by ba. side. Now. Try switching bah, back and forth between bah, these two videos. Bah, bah, Crazy, right? Bah. The illusion occurs because what we're seeing is clashing with what we're hearing. The visuals of what we're seeing overwrite what we're actually hearing. Try it for yourself. Close your eyes and you'll hear what the audio actually is. The remarkable thing about the McGurk effect is, even if you know exactly how it's done or the mechanics behind it, it doesn't seem to make any difference at all. Which just goes to prove the old adage, seeing really is believing.